All right, so I'm not exactly sure why that got cut off again. Mysteries never cease. Okay, or wonders never cease. Okay, so we could use the word discipline. And more. All right, so we have rule two. Let's just do a repeat over here. And we could use it more than one way. It is a homograph. That's right. Have the discipline to be successful. What do we do with these two words? Brace. Okay, so now we're going to go to some old special, some old words. And the word is special. Okay, so special, unique, original, exceptional, unusual, remarkable, outstanding, noteworthy, singular, uncommon, distinct, different. Okay, special. Let's go. Special. Special. So let's go. Special. Special. Right, so we need to put the first sound and underline the sh. Okay, now, when something is special or you're trying to um, explain something that's very particular, which is another great word for the word, uh, synonym for the word special, you have to be specific. Okay, you have to be particular, you have to be certain, you have to be very precise. So can you please be more specific? Can you please be more um, precise? Can you be more particular, more clear? Specific, let's go. Specific. Thick, specific. Let's go. Specific, specific. And when a multiple syllable word ends with ick, ish, or airy, in this case, ick, it is a an adjective. Okay. So how do we mark this up? First sound. And I see a rule right over here. That is rule two. Soft C when followed by Y, I, or E. I or E. Now, when you're being specific and you're trying to be very clear or exact or explicit and you're trying to identify things very precisely and define them or to indicate them or to give that detail, you are trying to specify something. Specify. Let's go. Specify. Remember that English words don't end with I. Specify. Specify. So let's go. How do we mark this up? First sound, third sound. Good. So I see a rule here, rule two. And also English words don't end with I. That is rule six. Specify. Okay. I'd like to specify what I was trying to say because my explanation wasn't that clear. All right. So what do we do with these three words? Triple brace. Okay. The next word. Skip down to number 13 is the word discuss. What's the word? Exactly. To discuss something is to speak or to converse or to chat or to talk. Discuss. Let's go. Discuss. Discuss. Let's go. Discuss. Discuss. Double consonant at the end. That is rule seven. Now we're going to put it in the past. Just say discussed and write it. We discussed many things on Google Meet. All right, let's just underline the third sound over here, please. Disgust. Now, what do we do with these two words? Excellent. We brace it. Now, we're going to get to the word disgust. Disgust. I know it sounds the same, it basically, because people say it so quickly. But to dis when, when something starts to disgust you, you get nauseated, you detest it, you get sickened by it, you're revolted or it's revulsion, you're it's offensive or repulsive. It's very distasteful. You loathe that. It's like uh, the yuck factor. Yucky. Okay. Ew. Can you believe what he does? That's disgusting. Right? It starts to disgust you. It starts to offend your sense of decency. <laughs> okay? Sometimes cleanliness. Like, it, it, think about Charlie Brown, right? Pigpen. He, 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 he starts to disgust someone like Lucy. But Pigpen, he's perfectly happy with who he is. He's fine. I, gotta get, I have to give him credit. Pigpen, he's got integrity. He knows who he is. Okay? Doesn't matter. He's not, you know, he just lives his life. Anyway, disgust. Let's go. Disgust. Disgust. You disgust me, some people will say. First syllable, dis. Second syllable, gust. All right, what do we do with disgust and disgust? And there is a difference, although it comes out very quickly. So for our purposes here, they sound the same, but they're spelled differently. It is a homophone. Okay, so let's go. Discuss, discuss, disgust, disgust, disgust. Specify, specify, 
specific, specific. Let me just put a little more loop in that F. All right, I have to be a little more precise and specific. Let's go. Special, special. Discipline, discipline. Disciple, disciple, a follower. Let's go. Community, community, communities. Extremely, extremely. It was extremely hot the other day. It was extremely cold. I am extremely honored to be in your presence. Ex Extreme, extreme. It was an extreme thrill to listen to Beethoven's music. Thrill, thrill. And again, thrill, thrills, thrilling, thrilled, thriller. Um, a good, a good uh, action movie or dramatic movie is a thriller. And yes, Michael Jackson's uh, album from many, many years ago. <laughs>